How do you feel on this day? How do I feel on this day? Um, hold on, I have a phone call. Whatever you want. Too busy. The police have changed their story every day. Um, and one day we're okay and the next day we're not. Um, I feel like we're being cooperative, as, as cooperative as possible, and we've tried to follow their rules for the last few days, and we're just trying to sit peacefully on the sidewalk, and we just don't really understand um, why they keep expanding the park and changing the rules of where you can and can't be, and, um, you know, we feel like we're just sitting peacefully, peacefully trying to tell people our message, and there's a lot worse things we could be doing. There's a lot worse things that are going on in this city right now. And we just wish that they would put their energy into something that's actually a crime and not peaceful people who are just sitting, sharing a message uh, with other people. So that's how I feel today. There's fireworks just for us. Hi. Hi. Where are we tonight? We're at, it is no, November the 11th. We are here to make a stand for freedom of speech. This is the, toward the end of APEC. This is the apex of the APEC night. Right? Yes, it is. I mean, it, it, there's tomorrow, of course, but it, what's unusual about tonight? Tonight is the apex of APEC. We are going to be facing down the police because at the Academy of Arts tomorrow, there's an APEC summit, and oh. they don't want us here. Oh, dear. So that is what's going on. Yes, it is. So these, these people, yeah. thank you. Is it maybe behind you? Thank you. We have. So how, how's everything going tonight? So you're just resting up here? Uh, yeah, just just brainstorming, resting up. Chewing any fat? Did you run out of food or? Uh, no, there's plenty of food here. Plenty of food. Yeah, we're just enjoying our time here in the protest command center. The command center. Yeah. Uh, so, so the tour. We're not commanding anything. Uh, there, there's a good sleeping headquarters. And that's yeah, the sleeping. I, we do everything here at the headquarters. Yeah. The pillow is the most important thing. <laughs> so this is my friend with the Apex shirt. Yeah. A recycled Apex shirt. Well, tomorrow's yeah. the last day of Apex, and this is like the Apex of the Apex here. Uh, I thought it went until Sunday. Oh, yeah. It is? Yeah, I think oh, good. so. Oh, There's more to come. Yeah. But for you guys, you're, 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 we'll see. Yeah, we'll see, right? Here. <laughs> oh, there he is. Thanks. Sorry to ambush you. Oh, hello. <laughs> yes, hello. That, that was a, a, a good. Uh, was that from the medieval times? Uh, yeah, that was Scar that was uh, Thomas Square from the uh, oh. the folk song Scarborough Fair. I just changed some of the words to fit with the movement, and um, it's uh, 
Yeah, it's from the, uh, it's like from either the 12 or 1300s, um, back when, back in the time when there was a Scarborough Fair in the, in the, uh, place of Scarborough in England. Sussex, was it? I don't know. What's that? Was it in Sussex? I have no idea. Scarborough. Oh, Scarborough. Okay. Yeah, and there used to be a fair there every year. But, but there, this, this is, this is another fair. Yeah, it's it's Thomas Square. Are you going to Thomas Square <laughs> instead of Scarborough Fair? Here tonight. What, what, what day is it and what, what, what's happening today? Today is 11, 11, 11. And uh, the cops have told us that they're going to come and we're all getting prepared to uh, to uh, stand up for our rights <laughs> and our constitutional right to assembly and we don't need a constitution to tell us that we are free to assemble. We just, you know, decided that it's a good idea to, for people to be able to freely assemble, you know. <laughs> I, uh, you know, I wonder, you know, okay, we always cite the constitution for this, but do we even need the constitution to tell us that we can freely assemble? I mean, this concept must have come before that, so. Was it Magna Carta? Around the time that your song applies. Magna Carta, but I mean, even then. We don't need a piece of paper to tell us that we need that we should be able to freely assemble, you know, and just be together and we're people and we're just assembling, you know. And it's like, okay, okay, we can all go to somebody's house, but then the cops will come over, bang, 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 you guys are too loud. So I mean <laughs> you know, I'm just against this, you know, police state and this hoax of a government. And most basic rights that I wanna assert is is uh, to have you know, healthy food, clean water, clean air, clean planet. Um, I want to uh, be able to live freely, uh, be able to express myself freely, be able to practice whatever uh, spiritual or religious things I want to practice. And uh, that is what I truly desire. And um, I don't want to be a slave to the monetary system. I don't want to be a slave to the government. And I don't want them to have to tell me what my rights are. I think it should be the other way around. I think the people should tell the government what we think is right. <laughs> and you change, you, you change the rights, and but but sometimes the, the government, forgive me for going into it, but sometimes the government, uh, ideally, it would be a group of people agreeing on what rights to go to, and they, they agree upon it, and that's kind of good. But then when it becomes taken over and it becomes onerous, then it's not that good, I guess. Yeah, and I, I'm not so sure how I feel about governments at all. So, you know, I, government is, I mean, every single person can act of their own volition. How many crimes have been committed uh, by people who are quote unquote just doing their job or quote unquote just following orders? You know, how many atrocities have been committed that way? Um, if everybody were to just act of their own free will, their own volition, and their own intention, I think people would be better people, especially if people were less desperate and they didn't feel this desperation to get all these things that they so-called need. Um, or if they just had the things that they need already, you know. Materialism would change things. So... I don't know if, uh, I just don't know if government is the answer. I, I feel like people can self-govern themselves and I feel like to some extent small groups can govern each other and decide what's okay. People in nature. Oh, look, you know, at, look at these. Like we told, we told the people who smoke to please smoke there and they're respecting what we asked them to do. You know, it's not the government who asked them to smoke sure. there. The people all decided, you know, please smoke there. Yeah. And they're doing it because they want to not offend people. Yeah. I feel like a larger society could also work that way. You know what I mean? Wow. But look, look at all this. This is an amazing parade. Do you want to see the parade here? It's a ton of fire trucks passing by. Why are they out? This is very strange. This is very interesting. This is very scary, actually. And it's happening on a 11, 11, 11. 
It's very strange. There's something surprising going on. Something weird. No, this is happening. <laughs> yeah. What is the precedent for this happening? Firefighters rock! <laughs> As confirmed, this is not now. part of the park. They have the tax map and they have the map and stuff. This is not part of the park. So we shouldn't be arrested. Wow. Hopefully. Crash but can, you, can you stand here? Is it legal to stand? Yeah. Okay. It's a sidewalk. Yeah. As long as you're not blocking someone. The police cited sex, section 10. They said it was. 2-1A subsection 13. All that says is the park closes when the park closes. It doesn't say anything about traversing the sidewalk. And, uh, That's an invention. There's, they oh. just came up with that. But what if, what if you're, you're all standing there blocking the sidewalk and there's no one to block? You can't. That's okay. I err on the side of caution 36 inches or whatever. Oh. So you have to leave 36 inches. Yeah, don't block it because. Okay, even though there's no people. Yeah, still okay. don't block it. Uh, so what night are we at? Where are we? Yeah. We're in what night? Five, I believe. Oh. Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, so Wednesday. So what, what curious different. things are happening today? Actually, what's curious things? We're just yeah. trying to figure out what the law is because police are very, very unclear about it and. They tend to be making things up as they go along. The handbook? Oh, in our Yeah, we usually walk over. Okay. That's <laughs> okay. What? Are these for the march? Uh, they're for, they're for the, the swim out tomorrow. The what? Oh, swim out. Yeah, I don't really know the detail. Lauren! Oh, um, we are tomorrow morning doing a Moana Surf Flotilla. We are going to paddle out, and we, so we made these specific signs. Um, we're going to stay within the um, public access zones, just because tomorrow is the start of the CEO Summit, and we want to have something very specific to Nooloha Apex, so... We've been working and putting these together. Thank you. A creative way, yeah? Freedom of speech. What, what, why are you here? To support and solidarity with the police? Yeah, of course, yeah. And, and, you know, see why the police would hassle people for basically peace, peaceful assembly. I don't understand it, but... Uh, <laughs> and then, did you meet uh, this other Occupy Wall Street person? Hi, I'm Actually, Rebecca. Rebecca? Danny, uh, right? Danny, yeah. I think I, did I meet you? At the yeah, you, I met you the other day. At the people's phone or no? At the conference. At the conference. Yeah. Did you go today? No, you were here. Yeah. Most of the day. Uh, I was in Waikiki. Oh yeah. But he's Thanks. Down at the end there, standing. Yeah. But are you gonna go down there? I'm just getting a scout. We learned of Lalani that we needed to scout. Yeah, okay. We learned of Lilani that scouting is a good thing to keep out of your eye to see what the best plan is. Thank you. I guess this is it. We're walking down the line here. Well, I'm just trying to line. get an idea of who else is lining up down there, what he's up to. We're just talking to someone there. This is the thin blue line. 